Millie. Millie. Oh, wait. Oh, you're not Millie. You're Caesar. Hi, Caesar. How are you? What can I do for you today? What is this? Oh, you brought me a book to read. Oh, oh, Caesar, you must not have heard. Summer reading is over. I know. Imagine your story is done for the summer. We'll do it again next summer. I know it was fun, wasn't it? I know, do you, but you really want me to read this, don't you? This is like one of your favorites, isn't it? Should I do it for the kids? Yeah, for the kids? You know, but I was really engrossed in my book. All right, I guess my book can wait. You, you want me to read Bear Snores On? Is, is this like your pick or something? Where'd you go? Oh, you're getting me something. Oh, look at this, Caesar's Picks. Oh, I know what you want to do. You want me to read your favorite books to the kids. Oh, now I get it. Okay, all right, we, we can read Bear Snores On. Bear Snores On is one of my favorites too. Did you know that? We'll put my book down. All right, Bear Snores On by Karma Wilson and Jane Chapman. You know what, Caesar? How about you go sit over there so that you can see the pictures better? Okay. I'll give you a second to get over there. Do, 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 do. Okay. Caesar's all set. All set. Caesar, all set. Bear Snores On by Karma Wilson. In a cave in the woods, in his deep, dark lair, through the long, cold winter sleeps a great brown bear. Whoa! Whoa! You must be a friend of Caesar's. Wow. You are a great brown bear. Wow. Okay. Cuddled in a heap with his eyes shut tight, he sleeps through the day and he sleeps through the night. The cold wind howls and the night sounds growl, but the bear snores on. <laughs> An itty bitty mouse, pitter pat tiptoe, creep crawls in the cave from the fluff cold snow. Mouse squeaks, too damp, too dank, too dark. So he lights wee twigs with a small hot spark. That's one way to stay around. The coals pit pop and the wind doesn't stop, but the bear snores on. <laughs> Two glowing eyes sneak peek in the den. Mouse cries, who's there? And a hare hops in. Long time no see, says hare. I'm sorry, ho mouse, says hare, long time no see. So they pop white corn and they brew black tea. Yum. Mouse sips wee slurps and hair burps big burps. <laughs> That's a big burp. But the bear snores on. A badger scuttles by, sniffs snuff at the air. I smell yummy yums. Perhaps we can share. What is this? A badger's t-shirt? Ah, ha, ha. way to go, prop guy. I have brought honey nuts, badger says with a grin. Let's dig them up. Cozy down and dig in. Prop guy, these are honey nut Cheerios. Ah. Caesar, we need to get a new prop guy. And they nibble and they munch with a chew, chomp, crunch. But the bear snores on. <laughs> a gopher and a mole tunnel up through the floor. Then a wren and a raven flutter in through the door. Mole mutters, what a night, what a storm, twitters wren. And everybody clutters in the great bear's den. They tweet and they titter and they chat and they chitter, but the bear snores on. In a cave in the woods, 
a slumbering bear sleeps through the party in his very own lair. Hare stokes the fire and mouse seasons the stew. Then a small pepper flake makes the bear... Achoo! Oh! <laughs> he blows and he sneezes and the whole crowd freezes. Oh. And the bear wakes up. Bear gnarls and he snarls. Bear roars and he rumbles. Bear jumps and he stomps. Bear growls and he grumbles. He does not sound like a happy bear. You've snuck in my lair, and you've all had fun, but me, I was sleeping, and I've had none. And he whimpers, and he moans, and he wails, and he groans, and the bear blubbers on. <laughs> <laughs> Mouse squeaks, don't fret, don't fuss, look, see, we can pop more corn, we can brew more tea. Bear gulps and bear gobbles, and he sighs with delight. Then he spins tall tails through the blustery night. And when the sun peeks up on a crisp, clear dawn, bear can't sleep. But his friends snore on. The end. Hello, bear. Now, I've heard a rumor that your name, where are you going? Your name is Uncle DJ. Is that true? Are you related to Caesar? Yeah, I wondered. You kind of look similar, although Caesar's a little bit. Well, hello, Caesar. Is this your, your family member, cousin, uncle? Yeah, well, it's very nice to meet Uncle DJ. And I'm so glad that you brought him. And I'm glad we had this chance to read our story, Bear Snores On. And I hope the kids all enjoyed it. Maybe we should do Caesar's Picks again next week. Yeah? And maybe the week after that? Okay. Well, we'll do some Caesar's Picks here just to finish off the month of August for all of our friends. And then we'll start something different in September. Great. Well, I hope everybody enjoyed it. And now I'm going to go back to my book if it's okay with you. Thanks, Caesar. Bye.